stand on the shoulders of incredible people. We owe our freedom to extraordinary people. The bad, the evil, doesn't have the last word. It's ultimately the goodness and laughter and joy and caring and compassion. Those are what are going to prevail in the end. I think all the others look on Nelson Mandela as kind of uh, our father figure. What Madima means to me is uh, freedom, the dignity. For all of us who are now elders, Mandela already in the 1970s, 80s, was someone we knew when he was in prison. And for me, he was a hero already then. I first met Madiba when I had the honor of being president of Ireland. And from that first moment, he was to me one of the most extraordinary people I have ever met and had the privilege of meeting. The essence of Madiba to me is that he has lived his values. When he was president of South Africa, I was the first person to travel to Robben Island with him to see his cell. He held my hand, he showed me this little cell. He has such humanity and it comes out, you know, in a way you are sure there is music in the room, even in complete silence. The last I met was, uh, we had a photograph with him in South Africa, the Jobel. I put a cotton yarn uh, garland on him, which was a symbol of Mahatma Gandhi. I think of Madiba as a guiding line. He speaks very deeply to everything I believe in. I stood beside him as High Commissioner for Human Rights, and he launched the South African Plan of Action for Human Rights. And uh, then he turned to me and he said, you know, there was a time when I was called a terrorist. And we both laughed, you know, that immediate humor after a very solemn occasion. He is somebody that I profoundly love. Our task is to unite humanity throughout the world. And uh, if you act as an individual, you will never be able to achieve that. I, I think I'm just aware of what an incredible gift uh, God has given us in him. It is an amazing thing that the ones that are held in high regard, who are revered, would be a former political prisoner. Because the world is saying, I hope that I too, if I were to have experiences such as your own, would emerge on the other side of that experience magnanimous. As a sinner, <laughs> I will expect you to write a letter to the big man up there. <laughs> If a man of your standing does that, yeah, when I knock at the door yes. of heaven, they will say, we will allow you to come in.